Hi everyone, um, my name is Harriet and this is Ben and we are the What Days. <laughs> um, so yeah guys, um, I've been trying to start this channel for a while now, mm. um, didn't, so we're really just chilling at home, not doing a lot, I thought we may as well, we may as well just you know, get into it and just start it anyway, just, just what the heck man, just try it you know. So yeah, so I'm so excited to be here today yeah. and um, I actually, I didn't want to come by myself, I decided to bring this guy so that you know like we can do it together um, and I think it will be more fun like that anyways. So I want today to be like a get to know us a little bit video um, and we're going to do it through the that game um, who's more likely. Ooh. So yeah, so yeah. <laughs> Alright, um, we'll just start with the questions and then yeah, we'll take it from there. Alright, well, so I'll, I'll just say it out and then we say whoever it is. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, so who is more likely to experience a heart attack? You eat unhealthy. <laughs> so I eat unhealthy? Yeah. You eat Are healthy sure about once that? in a while. But I always eat whole food. So but it mean, whole food doesn't mean it's healthy food though. But the food that you make at home, they're not healthy. Exactly. Like your, your, your people's food has like so much oil in it. So it's not really. Alright, let's it's put not, it this way. There's green, but it's really oily. Yeah, but not as much as the outside food well, that you eat more. No, but when I eat, I try to eat healthy stuff. I do. So. No, you don't. Anyways, alright, so I guess it's me. Yeah. And I have a lot of sports. I so yeah, I yeah. Like that's, that's a good reason. Not yeah. I eat unhealthy because you know I don't eat that unhealthy. Like, I eat some takeaway, but I actually eat healthy most of the time. That's true. But it is true, like, he does way more sports like he's way more active so he probably live longer because he's more active so yeah <laughs> so tired who is more likely to become famous me because i'm already yeah, famous no he's not i'm famous. already famous people already know me out there you know my name ben whenever you whenever you start somewhere just say ben man you'll be out so yeah more famous, but so dry, just say Ben and you'll be out. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. um yeah, I think he's more likely to be famous because um he plays soccer and a lot of people, a lot of people know him like that. Yeah, a lot of people know him through soccer. And, and that's fame. And that's about it. That's, that's the only reason. That's what fame that's is. not fame. That's not what, fame. What is fame man? Do you play for Chelsea or or Arsenal? No you don't. That's just Are you famous? Name. No you don't. We're talking about I mean, fame. No, you're not. We're talking about fame. <laughs> That's fair. Anyways, alright, so next one. Um, do the most embarrassing things while drunk. Him. Because he's done some really embarrassing things. Plus, I don't drink, so you're not going to see me, you're not going to catch me. That was in the past, things. but now I'm in Christ. Who cares? You still so, did them. No. Did you not no, do that? But you not do that? I'm a new man. Should we list them? I'm a new man. Should we list the things in that Jesus you did? Name. Let's go on. Next question, please. Anyways, um, who is more likely to date a celebrity? <laughs> a famous guy, you know. Oh, Stomp the yard, you know that. What? What? <laughs> what do you mean, Stomp the yard? Nah, it's a movie, don't worry. Yeah, yeah, but I don't understand. I'm not understanding the connection. You, are you saying you're you a dancer like them? Nah, same the girl. Like the, the girl is Stomp the yard. It's my crash. crash. That's good for you. That's that's nice. But she's a Christian no, now, so I don't you care. Know. Who cares? Yeah. Sorry. But who would? Who would? Though? Who's most likely? We both care, cause my no, baby. He's my baby is <laughs> probably him. Too nah, much. my. I don't. I don't really care about celebrities that much. My baby is beautiful, so yeah. Okay. Celebrity will both one. And, yeah, you know. Next one. Um. Read a hundred books in a year. Me, me. Because niggas don't read. I, I read. Like these niggas don't read. I read so. by the word of God. I don't have to read another book. You barely, God, barely in even. In Jesus' name, barely. I read His word. Yeah. You probably just listen to His word. That's it. That's still it says in the Bible. Listen to His word. Yeah. Start a family sooner than expected. You. Why? Because you want kids, you want kids way more, yeah, way before. earlier than me. Yeah. 
But that's the point. Like, so her family. When you say so, so that they expected, expected, what? Yeah, what, but what who, that? like, who actually, who is already wanting to start having family? No, but that's not so that they expected. Like, no, but, uh, but already, between yeah. us, though, between us two, who, who wants to start a family? Already. Sooner than they expected. Doesn't matter. That means something like you made a mistake or something. No. Uh, well, not that they made a yeah. mistake. Like people didn't think that you were gonna actually start a family already, but you did. Like yeah. That. But Either way, you were happy to start a family like as soon as. I don't really. Yeah. Much. Yeah. Not so, not that. That's not true. No. Even then, before that. Not really. Well, you were keen. That's the point. You're more keen than I. Cause I'm just like, oh, whatever. Yeah, but when I'm married. Yeah. Yeah, obviously. Yeah. Don't be strange, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Silly. <laughs> Alright, um, be a supermodel. Me. <laughs> supermodel? Nah, sorry. I'm married. This guy thought... What? What were you doing? Nah, what? This guy yeah. thought... Yeah. He was gonna be a model. Guy, I, a stripper model. I... I had the chance, serious. but... Serious. But... When your lady says something, sometimes it's smart. So... I didn't... For everyone to come and watch him... Amen. Where about to come and watch? Um, my body is the body is the temple of Christ. So I can't put it out there. Mm hmm Exactly. Yeah. Plus, which other girl gonna be watching you? No, no one. So sorry. Yeah. That's a quiet one. Very quiet. All right. Um, pull a prank on a friend. Definitely him. I've done a thousand of them, so I'm still gonna do more. So yeah. This guy's a clown, man. Um. From the movie. Get a girl by writing a poem. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm not trying to get girls. So. I, I, and he doesn't even who, do you, have you ever written a poem before? Roses are red, violets are blue. If you don't want to come blue. home with me, <laughs> can I come home with you? <laughs> so, yeah, see? You're so dry. Oh, yeah. Bob, you're so dry. It, like, it's yeah. a poem. See, I'll make you laugh. I'll take you home already. <laughs> um, move to another continent. I'll go straight away with yeah. my hobby. Yeah, he would. I would. Because I'm good with change. She's not really good with like change, it. but she will, will yeah. still get along. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I don't really like. No, I like. I like staying in one place. Like, and I feel like I miss home. Doesn't matter where I go. Like, obviously, because we we're in Australia at the moment, we, mm. and we I grew up here in Perth, we're and I don't see up, anywhere yeah. else. Yeah, I don't see anywhere else as home. Mm. To be honest, even though I'm from Africa. No, it's. It's just it's the fact that she doesn't like change. That's yeah. all. Because you can be born somewhere and be there your whole life. And but Perth, still go to no, but Perth is just it's Perth home, man. Because like yeah. we've been like we haven't done that much trouble, but we've been to a few places, mm. and every time it's like there's nowhere like home. There's nowhere yeah, like where you've grown up. You know, that's you've true. been to other states and stuff. Like even school. even so still to now, for me, even though I grew up here, I came here when I was really young. Yeah. Whenever they talk about home, I think back in Africa. Yeah. That's home because I have from childhood, but here is still home. If I go to Africa, I'll still want you to still come back like, here. Because yeah, yeah. yeah, when we went back as well, it was yeah. a bit like, oh man, but it's like, no, that's home, this is not home. But True. I don't know, I think home is where you grow up, I uh, guess. True that. So yeah. True that. Um, we have like three, four more. Three, four. Um, it says, be an undercover agent, Ben. <laughs> I'm a complete actor, bro. <laughs> Give me any scene right now, act it out. Shout out to the actor. If it was who would be the best actor, it still be me as well. So, secret agent. Take drugs. Hey, guess what? I've never taken who drugs. Who is supposed to take drugs? That was back in the day. I've never taken drugs. He was hanging out with druggies. I was hanging out with druggies, but the back then I still didn't have some. So, what makes you think I was But who's more likely? If you, had, if you, to if you had a bad friend, you probably would. Nah. Even though I'm I had not, bad I'm friends, I'm not that easy. Did it. I'm not influenced that easy. Like, I'm not. It, well, yeah, think about it. You, you're not, but but you're more likely because you hang around a lot of people like that. And if your friends are like, oh, try it, try it, you might be like, they oh, all try. did. Yeah. Most likely, so, all of them did. And I still you, they tried. If you stayed long enough in that environment, I was there since I was from 11 to around 19. Two more, two more. Um, who is more likely to have plastic surgery? You. Why? I love the way I look. Well, that Ladies means... always want to put makeup and all these yeah, different true. things. I guess. Yeah, yeah, but I don't. But I, yeah, yeah, that's true. Like he doesn't really care. I oh, care yeah. about. I care about how I look and stuff. So, like, like, but I wouldn't have plastic surgery because, like, if, if you for me, let me put it this way: if they if they came up to you and they're like, oh, we can make you look exactly like this. 
without makeup any well, day of the maybe week. If I wasn't, maybe if I wasn't in Christ. No, nah, even now I'm no. saying. So, no, because if they no, tell you you can look exactly like this, no makeup every day, no. you look like you have makeup on. No. No. I wouldn't take it because, yes. because yeah. being in Christ now, I know that all my features that mm. God made for me, mm. He made specifically for me, mm. and that I am beautiful, beautifully and wonderfully made. And mm. me doing other things to my body and mm. like changing the way they are mm. is saying it's kind of like an insult to God. It's saying God, like, true, true. Um, I'm not happy with what You gave true. me because technically everything that we do, like you know, our hair, our makeup, everything, but it's just it's for, for me, it's just an accessory. But Accepting who I am, accepting myself as I am, is saying, God, thank you for making me the way I am. So that's why but, I don't want to do anything. And also, like, but isn't that kind of the same thing as well? That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. But I'm not gonna go to the extent of changing myself completely. Like these are not, these are temporary. These are like not like permanent things that I can never change again. Do you know what I mean? Like I can play around with it and do whatever I want with it, but it's, it doesn't change who I am. It doesn't change like the person that I am and what I believe and what I think see as important, you know? It's the same, I guess it's the same as plastic surgery, but for mm -hmm. me, I just don't really believe in that. Like, I just feel like, nah, there's no point. Like, and if I, what if I change it? And we've seen so many, remember that, remember that um, show? Remember that show? Yeah. About, like, like, you know, you change all these things and then imagine if it turns out wrong. Next minute, you have no breasts. Stuck with it. You have oh, no, one of them are like this. Your bum is like this. One is here, and one, one of your breasts is here, and one is like here. That's quiet, dead. And your bum is like quiet, sticking so out. So you just never know what could go wrong, man. So, nah. Sorry. Like, I think I think if I was younger, probably, because I used to have oh, insecurities. I love insecurities and now she's like, like, oh, you know. I wish I was like this, or oh, I wish I was this, oh, mm -hmm. I wish I had my face like this, or that, or that. But now I'm just like, I go, this is what, what, Make God, up with the this is what God gave me. I'm going to work with it, you know? So. Yeah. But it's you. Anyways, yeah. Guys, we've come to the end of this video because mm. we're really doing a lot. We're talking a lot. So, um, yeah, I guess like, um, we're, I don't know. I feel like um, in this season and in this time, um, guys do putting it by heart to just, um, like, you know, like, start something that you've always wanted to start. Mm. Um, and I've been reading a lot of books as well, which say, you know, like, if you don't do all the things that you've always wanted to do, um, you know, like, or you've had in your heart or have a desire to do, when you get older, you're going to look back and you're going to be like, why didn't sure. you do it? You know, exactly. like, why didn't you do what you wanted to do? Now it's too late, like, you can't do it, you know? So, I think this is one of the things that I've always wanted to do, but I just ha had the desire, I'm like, mm, nah, that's quite, I don't, I don't know, I don't know. But yeah, so, now that we've started it, I want you guys to know that, um, yeah, we're going to be bringing, um, just bringing you guys different topics, different, um, um, like discussions and just chats about different things like mm. for example um, like the thing that God put in my heart is just you know health wellness and um, spirituality so we're going to be you know talking a lot about some, some of those things things that you know involve those 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 topics and like even like relationships as well because you know um, you know we just recently got married and months locked down we just recently got married and, and yeah, I guess we've, we've learned quite a lot already, like in mm. just the year and a bit that we've, that we've been married and living together, we've learned so much and I think it's always so good to like, you know, share experiences and, and encourage people because, you know, we learn so much from different people's experiences, you know, um, and I love watching um, people's, you know, different perspectives from different people as well and just learning from them as well. So I thought, you know, let's start one as well and let's share our experiences and hopefully, you know, it's a blessing. And, Something that will help you guys out as well in some way, shape, or form. Yeah, so, guys. Yeah. That's so, yeah, we'll see you later, guys. Bye, bye, bye. Guys, thank you guys so much for watching, um, and we'll see you in our next video. Bye.